Hi, Lou here to discuss one general or, or you might say broad view of how to negotiate. And I say one view because this was specifically about negotiation by a soccer player's agent negotiating with clubs about transfers and contracts. And I have the URL here on the, the uh, slide if you want to go look at it yourself. I'm thinking of these, especially in terms of the game diplomacy, which is in some ways the ultimate negotiation game. So there are eight of these points. Number one is seek the opportunity. Quote, change creates opportunity and opportunity creates negotiation, unquote. Sometimes this is posed as look for new or other solutions. Uh, it may be a reason why negotiation can take so long in the real world because the participants are searching for alternative ways to accomplish something. Number two is preparation from all perspectives. Quote, be really clear on all the possible outcomes. Brilliant. Okay. I can live with that. And what's my plan B if it is not going the way I want to go? Unquote. In other words, have multiple possible objectives so that inability to achieve one doesn't end the entire negotiation. And ask yourself, what will be good enough? Okay. It helps to know ahead of time. Point three, negotiation currency. Quote, what are the different things that people value? These can be wages, image rights, bonuses, deal length, sell-ons. The more of those you create, the less likely you will have a deadlock down the line. If you are negotiating on one variable, you probably won't come to an agreement. Unquote. Sometimes this is posed as try to establish a standard for comparison of what is valued. Four, learn the history and precedence. I haven't, haven't got a quote here, but in games, it's the history within the game and the history in past games. You can ask yourself, is this, is this player one who often betrays others? Now, some people think past performance should be ignored. And to me, that's like evil characters who think lawful good is stupid. Usually it's the least trustworthy who want previous history to be ignored. Is it metagaming to pay attention to previous history? I don't know, but I'm going to do it. Five, where does the power lie in the negotiation and what is the plan to change it? Quote, we try to make it less confrontational by aligning people's goals, but one of the things we talk about is power, unquote. So, if one side has all the power, how can the other side expect to achieve anything it desires? For that matter, what gives you power, quote unquote? What gives the other side power? You need to know that to succeed in a negotiation. Six, what can go wrong in a negotiation? Identify, evaluate, and mitigate risk. Quote, you have to scenario plan all the different ways it might play out and spend some time on the different phases so you don't just end up on the last day trying to do a deal." Unquote. Now, as with many of these tips, the idea is to anticipate what might happen and be ready with a plan for it, or in one word, plan. Seven, internal alignment, create and maintain it. Quote, it's very hard, but it's crucial. Your whole organization needs to be agreed, not only actually agreeing, but communicating that you are agreed." Unquote. Now in games, this is rarely a problem because there is normally only one person per side, but there are games where there are several people per side and then this ap applies. Eight, role play and practice until you are perfect. So no one should go into a negotiation without practicing beforehand. But, in games, we typically practice as we play. Also, there are frequently many more possibilities in a game than in a contract negotiation, although sometimes there are fewer. But, face, let's face it, it's a lot more serious when you negotiate somebody's 
wages for a long time than it is playing a typical game. So if we were going to characterize this view, it's don't do it by the seat of your pants. Gather information and plan for many possibilities. Now that's not the way people play games these days, but you're going to succeed better if you do it this way. Thanks for listening.